On Friday, Jesus died on a cross and was buried in a tomb shut with a heavy stone. But Sunday morning, that tomb was open and they believed. Well, he died on Friday. That was the first day. And that he was dead on Saturday. That was the second day. And this is Sunday morning and it's the third day. And just like Jesus promised, Jesus rose up from the dead to be alive again, alive forevermore. And they dashed off and they ran all the way back to where the disciples were hiding because they were afraid that the people who had arrested and killed Jesus might come and arrest and kill them too. Now, it was a very different scene inside that room. This was a sad and sorry group of men in hiding, brokenhearted, when these women came rushing to the door and they knew where they were hiding, so they were able to find them. And they said, let us in, let us in. We have good news. And they told them what had happened. They told them about going to the tomb and going inside and seeing the empty grave clothes. And while they were trying to figure it out that the angels had appeared to them and they had said, why are you looking for someone who's alive where only a dead person should be? And they said, don't you remember? He told us when we were in Galilee. Remember? He told us this was going to happen. And now Jesus is risen from the dead. And the women were so excited. And they were just going on and all talking at the same time. But the disciples, they listened to what the women said but they thought it was just nonsense and they didn't believe it. But Peter was there too. Now, the night that Jesus was arrested, Peter had denied that he even knew Jesus three times. And that broke Peter's heart when Jesus looked at him. And Peter got up and he opened the door and he risked going out into that morning where the sun was beginning to rise. And Peter ran and ran and ran and ran to that little tomb and he stooped down and he looked inside the door and he saw the grave clothes and he saw that they was empty and he didn't know what to think. Well, I'll tell you what happened. Jesus rose up from the dead to be alive again, alive forevermore. And on this special day, I like to say, Jesus Christ is risen. He is risen indeed. Now, kiddo, you remember, Grandma Goody loves you, but God loves you more. 